going on y'all this is your boy scotty and i'm here for another brand so i just want to i just decided that i wanted to give my two cents on the situation that's been going on on the internet for the last couple of days now i'm not stupid and i'm not blind i know exactly what's going on with unwind with tasha k Nick at Night, Armin Wiggins, and T.S. Madison. I know all about what's been going on. Yes, I've been watching it, and yes, it's very interesting, might I say. I follow most of these people anyway. I follow Armin Wiggins. I follow Nick at Night. I do follow Unwind with Tasha K. Don't really follow T.S. Madison like that. Never really have, but you know, from time to time, I might just see what she got to say. But other than that, you know, the rest of the, the other three, I, I do follow them. I do subscribe to all three of them, and I do watch them. So, the debate at hand is about the, derog the derogatory term called fish, and whether it's a derogatory term or not. So, I wanted to come in and give my two cents because, you know, for the last maybe year or so, I have been accused of being misogynist and I hate black women and all of this other stuff because of certain terms that I've used. Now, I will say that the term fish, I've been in the gay community for the last, what, I came out the closet in 2008, messed around with my first guy in 2008 and I was 19. Here I am in 2020, just turned 31. So, that means I've been in this world for the past 12 years of my life and the term fish has always been prominent in this world and what I mean by that is whenever we would say fish we was talking about a woman but I never really knew because you know when we would say fish you'd be like oh fish cute or fish a bad bitch or you know I need me I need to call my fish friend up or whatever you know it was never anything that was nasty in my eyes like I never felt like fish was talking about a woman's vagina smell or anything like that because that's not what we were saying like real talk I never knew that it was a derogatory term until maybe a couple of months ago I did a video about Kaya and Bobby Lights and um I was defending Bobby Lights against Kaya because whenever Kaya goes in on a gay man the first thing that she does is make AIDS jokes and HIV jokes. And I always feel like this just, okay, that is just so low beneath the ground. Like, you don't have anything else to um, roast and gag somebody about, especially with them being gay. Okay, so because I'm gay, that means I got HIV and AIDS. That's the best you can come up with when you're talking about somebody gay. So, yes, I said that. And a couple of black women was all in their feelings about me defending Bobby against what Kaya was saying as far as the AIDS jokes. And it was like, well, you know, black gay men feel like they can say whatever they want to say about us. Black gay men can call us fish and get away with it and, and think we're, we're not supposed to have a problem with it. And I'm just sitting up here like, what? I was taken aback by that because I never knew that the term fish was supposed to be derogatory. I honestly never knew that. And I feel like if we say fish, that, that gives women, well black women, because I don't know no white women like that, black women the nerve to call us faggots or punks or sissies and shit like that. Now, I'm going to be real with you. I don't like to be called a faggot. I don't like to be called a punk and I don't like to be called a sissy. And I really don't like to be called a girl either. You know what I mean? So, we could just move that out the way. Don't call me no punk. Don't call me no sissy. Don't call me no faggot. And please don't call me girl. Sometimes, okay, but please don't call me girl all the time. I don't like that girl shit most of the time. Please don't. Especially, like, if I don't know you, don't call me girl. Please don't. So, I get it. If a woman doesn't want to be called fish, then she doesn't have to be called fish. Like, if a woman says she, she, she would prefer that you don't call her fish, then don't call her fish. But what I don't understand is, fish is so derogatory, you know, because sometimes, it's, for me, when it comes down to black women sometimes, and I'm not here to um, bash black women, because let's just be real, black women are my audience. Gay men don't watch my shit, gay men don't fuck with me. So therefore, you know what I mean, I'm not here, I would never bash any black women. But I get confused sometimes, because it's like, if I get called a misogynist, if I call the women on the basketball wives bitches. But in the same breath, 
some women call themselves bitches. Like, I'm that bitch. I'm a bad bitch. I'm this type of bitch. I'm, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm a hood bitch. I'm this, I'm that. But why can I call you a bitch? And half of the time, when I call you a bitch, it's not to be malicious. It's I'm in entertainment mode. I'm doing these videos. Nothing that I'm doing in front of the camera is supposed to be taken seriously anyway. So I'm really roasting and gagging pretty much. Like, I'm not going all the way in. Bitch is just the word that I say all the goddamn time. I don't give a fuck if you're a man or a woman. I call you a bitch. It's in playful fun. But if you don't want me to call you a bitch, then I won't call you a bitch. But if I'm just sitting up here talking about black... Uh, if I'm just sitting up here talking about Ellen and Jennifer, if I'm calling them a bitch, why are you offended? I'm not calling you a bitch, I'm calling them one. And half the time it's because they were acting like a bitch. You know what I'm saying? So, I don't understand. Sometimes I don't get it. Like, you know, you get mad at me for calling you a bitch, but you call yourself a bitch. You know what I mean? So, I do get kind of confused by that sometimes. You know, it's really not up for me to understand because I'm not a black woman, so I don't know. But I never knew that fish was a derogatory term. Now, in my eyes, if, if a woman says, don't call me fish, I don't like it, give her, the, give her that respect not to call her that. You know what I mean? I feel like if she already told you she don't want to be called that, give her that respect and don't call her no bitch. It's simple as that. Like, it ain't nothing to argue about. Like, if she don't want to be called no bitch, she ain't got to be called one. Simple as that. Like... What the fuck we arguing about it for? Like, she already told you, don't call me no bitch and we good. I mean, not bitch. Don't call me no fish and we good. Like, I would say that I have a best friend that I've known since the first grade. And she embraces that word fish. Like, she created a group message with me and, and my two other guy friends. And, it's, and the name of the group message is Three Guys and a Fish. Let me get my phone out so y'all can see for y'all still. Hopefully y'all can see it. Um, let me see. Let me pull it up. Okay. Do y'all see that? Three guys and a fish. That's what it says. Three guys and a fish. So, she made that group. And she embraces that whole fish title. She was like, because you know I'm one of the only fish friends y'all got. Blah, 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 blah. So, she never took it as a derogatory term. But that's kind of like when gays, I don't understand them either. And I'm a gay guy, and a lot of the times I don't understand other gays. Because certain things that people say in regards to gays really don't offend me. You know, so it's kind of like, I remember when the Real Housewives of Atlanta was on and Nene called um, Kenya's friend a queen and she said something about Funky Dineva and um, Derek J when they was um, refereeing the Bailey Bowl and she was like, I wish they would just stop being queens and be referees. They was mad with Nene for calling them a queen. But I never knew that queen was a derogatory term because some, some of them call each other queens and shit. So I'm like, so queen is a derogatory term. Just like I never knew that tranny was a derogatory term. I never knew that tranny was a derogatory term. I thought that that was just a, a short abbreviated thing for transsexuals or trans transgenders. I never knew that transvestite wasn't the correct word to use because that's the term I've heard for years. I heard the term transvestite since I was a little boy. So I thought that was something that was okay to say. Everybody used to say it. So I can be ignorant to things like this. So I still, in all, I don't see how fish is a derogatory term. I feel like it's, it's, it's in a way, within the way that you use it. I guess it's kind of like nigga is a derogatory term, but yet us black people call each other nigga. So it's, it's like... It's like double standards in a sense, you know what I mean? Like it's like it's just like a give and take, give and take, give and take. But only you can decide what you can be called or what you can't be called. So you we, we really can't be so can we really be mad with a person, with a woman when she says, I don't want to be called fish? Can we really be upset about that? Because I wouldn't understand a person being upset with me because I don't want to be called a sissy. I wouldn't understand a person being mad with me because I don't want to be called a faggot. I wouldn't understand a person being mad with me because I don't want to be called a punk. 
I can't stand it when black men refer to most gay guys as punks. I hate that shit. And I always say, don't refer to me as such because I'm nobody's punk. Let's get that clear. I ain't nobody punk, so we ain't even do it. You know what I'm saying? So, I get it to a certain extent. But, it's really about what you see it as. Like, it's just like certain women don't want to be called bitches. If a girl tell me, please don't call me a bitch, I don't like it, I won't call them a bitch. Because I say the word bitch all day, every day. Everybody know, bitch is my favorite fucking word. I will call you a bitch all day and don't think nothing of it. And most people don't care about me calling them a bitch because they know that I don't mean no harm when I say it. But it may be some people that don't want to be called this shit and I got to respect this shit. You get what I'm saying? So, all in all, it's really about what's respectful to one person and what's not. If a, if a person don't want to be called a bitch or a fish, then they ain't got to be called it. We can't really be mad about something that a person prefers and what they don't prefer. You know what I'm saying? And I understood where Nick at night was coming from. She just simply stated, I don't like that term fish. I don't call me no fish. I understood where Nikki and Knight was coming from. I wasn't mad with her at all. I don't feel like she's being um, any type of way by saying she don't want to be called no fish. She ain't got to be called it. If she don't want it, she ain't got to take it. Period. Why be mad about it? Why be mad? A lot of women don't want to be called fish. I may not think it's a derogatory term. But the next person may think that, and they don't, and they prefer not to be called it. And I choose not to disrespect them and call them this shit, just because I don't feel like it's a derogatory term. I understood where Nikki and Knight was coming from. I didn't understand where T.S. Madison was coming from. Like I didn't understand why she was going the fuck off on Nikki and Knight, because I don't feel like she really said anything or did anything that was fucked up. I didn't understand. But I also understood what Armin Wiggins was saying too. So I see it from both sides here. I see it from both sides of the coin. You know what I mean? Like, I get Nick at night and I get Armin Wiggins because, of course, I'm going to understand where Armin is coming from because he gay just like me. So when we say in fish, we ain't talking about a woman's vagina. We're talking about her being a bad bitch. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know. Fish is cute. Fish is a bad bitch. You know what I'm saying? Fish got it going on. That's what we're saying. We're not saying fish like you smell like a fish market. We ain't talking about your coochie stank. We ain't saying none of that. We just we just identifying you as fresh fish. You know, fish is fish is the fish is the bomb. Fish is cute. Fish is bad. Fish is beautiful. That's what we're saying. But if a woman, if a certain female don't want to be called fish. To me, I don't even get why it's a big up one, but I do appreciate the discussion, the conversation. I do, but I don't see why it's such a big deal. Like, she don't want to be called fish. But I understood you getting night though. As a gay man, I understood you getting night. Um, also as a gay man, I understood Armin Wiggins because he didn't really drag. He didn't drag me getting night at all. But like T.S. Madison, she drove the fuck out of me getting night. But I didn't see why. But that's my take on the whole fish situation. What do you guys think about it? Um, leave it below. Make sure you guys follow me on um, Instagram at Scotty underscore by underscore nature. Be sure to like, rate, comment, subscribe, and share this video. And, and here it is. I'm always here for all your ratchet ass needs. Whether it be for commentary on ratchet reality shows, hot topics such as this one. Or all things real talk. With that being said, you guys, I'm out of here. Live from this empty ass living area. And I'm out of here. Peace out.